I've had this particular thing in mind to talk about for the past two weeks now, and I've just been postponing and pro pro postponing and postponing. <music> Hey lovelies, you're welcome back to my channel. How are we all doing? I hope everyone is doing fine. I've had this particular thing in mind to talk about for the past two weeks now and I've just been postponing and pro pro postponing and postponing. You <laughs> don't mind me, the word is postponing, it's not postponing. <laughs> so I'm happy I'm finally talking about it. In a world where surviving is really tough, not just in Nigeria, okay? Surviving is tough not just in nigeria but in the world generally the cost of living these days is scary like the cost of food and the rest of them you agree with me that it is really not easy surviving most people don't even have food to eat currently as we speak most people don't have up to three square meals per day so as difficult and as challenging as it seems currently in the world today Finding one or two persons who would say, Oya take, I'm giving this to you as a gift and it's from my heart. Like gifting you either with money or something else is rare. Like it's rare you find people actually gifting people these days. I'm not saying people don't gift anymore. People actually do. But it's rare you see someone say, take this. So my point is, whenever you are opportuned to meet that one man or that woman who would say, take this it's from my heart or take that this is from my heart what is expected of you who is the receiver is to appreciate whatever it is you are giving the saying says that blessed is the hand that giveth than the hand than the one that receiveth the both persons both the receiver and the giver are actually blessed but the receiver may miss out on his blessings when he receives such gifts grudgingly there are actually some people that when they receive gifts from people whether cash or any other thing they feel especially when it comes to cash they feel ah, ah this man now gone now eh why are you going to give me this kind of money <laughs> the truth of the matter is you should be appreciative of the fact that he, he even thought it in his heart to give it to you so whatever you are giving as a gift cherish it appreciate it and that is one of the ways you can be blessed for receiving that gift so you going ahead to weigh the gift you are giving and weigh the person giving the gift does not really make sense i mean this person actually thought it in his heart to give to you with this cash or with any other thing he has gifted you with okay so it is expected of you to just be appreciative don't begin to say ah this ah, this man now again now this woman now madam now ah, she's supposed to give me something way past this one you know as we humans talk at times okay so it is wrong actually things are really hard the poor the rich everyone is going through one thing or the other some may be going through financial issues and they still thought it in their hearts to give you with some cash you should be grateful the least you could do is just to say thank you and let that thank you come from a place of appreciation really okay let it come from a place of appreciation let it not be that you say thank you in your in the front of this person and behind you are beginning to say all manner of things no it is not right so i'm actually Every one of those who when gifted i'm ready to thank you like say tomorrow no day i'm ready to say thank you thank you for the whole of the day and even till tomorrow i'm actually one of those because i understand these things okay so i wouldn't come to weigh you i wouldn't come to judge you because you know what you have done this from a place of love from a place of maybe appreciation or concern so, so the least we could just use to say thank you and also pray for them all right so i just thought to drop this here and if you watch up until now thank you so much for watching as you can see i'm sweating i just got back from somewhere i'll see you in my next video